Alright, here we go! Last five turns! Let's do this! There's only a few turns left. Let's see how everyone is faring. Boo is in first place. By 10 coins. Ahead of Toadette, who's in second. Mario's in third, and First with Peach is in last. Anything can happen in the last few turns. Keep giving it your all. Poor Peach is in last place. You can spin the bonus wheel. What will the bonus be? Spin the wheel to find out. And it is the most basic one again. Red Spacer and Blue Spacer are now triple. We, meaning we can either gain 9 coin or lose 9 coin. You will also happen if player lands on the same space. But you knew that already. Just, anyway, uh, going to make sure, going to be absolutely sure I can steal a star from Toadette because that is an opportunity I do not want to miss. Seriously, I don't want to miss it. All right, all right, Pink Boo. Do your dirty work. Hee <laughs> hee I'll be right back. Bye bye. Bye bye, dear star. We Boo work as a team. I, I stole a star from you. It feels so awesome to be evil. It feels so awful to be mischievous ghost. Really? I'm a ghost and you are too. That's why I call you one of my best friends. Aside from my other buddies that I n know online. But any time, I love to stir up trouble. <laughs> uh, did I just... No, I didn't. Let's see. Mushroom orb. Uh, what do I wish to do? Do I want to keep the twomp or do I... Do I want to get rid of one of my mushrooms? Well, you know, as much as I like the Twomp Orb, I'm gonna get rid of it. Honestly. Uh, so I'm dueling again. Well, this was, oh shoot, this was something I was hoping not to hit. Um, I, I, you know what? Fine. We'll do double star. So it's either I'm leading or she's leading. Depending on what this next minigame is. Hopefully it's not something too bad. And it don't look like it will be, potentially. Next is light up my night. Scramble through the dark maid to find candles and set them ablaze. Whoever lights five candles first is the winner. Control stick move, A to light candles. The candle location and stage layout change each time you play. Meaning it's different every time we play this minigame. Essentially what it's saying. Go. Let's see who will win. So far it looks like the answer is me. And... E easily it demolished her right there. A lot of those were right close to me. It's like the game wanted me to get two stars in one turn. And... And steal them from Toadette. For the better. <laughs> because because trying to bait for one coin, that would have not done me any good. So now I'm the so now I have a big target on my back. And you know what? I do not mind having the target on my back, cause I am gonna do all I can to win. I'd like to play hard. I had a feeling that was going to be a decent bid. I kind of wish I was lucky to have that. But whatever. Something to miss. This is a... Alright, so something to miss. This is another... This is a mini game I, I'm pretty glad I did not have with some of my previous duel. Basically, you're looking for a gym and trying to feel the rumble to where that gym may be. 
basically what I like to do here is I like to pay attention to the tree. See where they're all at. But so far it looks like Princess Peach is ahead. Oh, but Mario answers back and and it's now even. Will Mari take back the lead? Take the lead? No! Peach recovered the lead, unfortunately. Last gym collection with it! Next one wins the game! Who's gonna get 30 coins? Will it be Mario or will it be Peach? It is... Princess Peach! I was kinda hoping Mario, to be honest. Yeah, I'm a little disappointed that wasn't Mario, if I'm going to be honest. But whatever. But like I said, I have a huge target on my back. Currently as of now. But really, that's fine, because... I'm better at these minigames than they are, anyways. And it looked like Toad is going to be moving ahead of just, I believe it's three spaces, if I'm being honest. And laying on her own space, looks like. That's a big, that's a big reward you get if you land on your own space. Good grief. Proves super helpful, too. Uh, no ch no chance time, thankfully, but she just went past the star. Scratch that, she was past it anyway. Anyway, Lift Leaper is the next four-player minigame on this list. And this is a platforming minigame. Leap over Chasm and between moving Lift to reach the goal, where it reaches the Goal first is the winner. Control take to move, A to jump. Watch how the lift move and time your jump carefully. Yeah. Basically Super Mario Brothers platforming to be real on it. And it's a and it and it and it shows off a pretty good execution. Now to be frankly honest. Toad that's ahead of me, but not by much though. Looking good, looking good. No, nothing stupid happened right now. Oh, but that kind of did. Missing that platform just now. I kind of lost a little bit of time there. There on that run. But a good lead, though. Not gonna beat the record, sadly. Uh-huh. Oh, come on! Oh, come on! I pressed the A button, game. There we go. No chance the AI had with that mini game. Imagine if I was, do yeah. Imagine if I was doing this on hard or brutal difficulty. I'd probably be trailing right now, to be honest. But, but I'm glad I'm not. But, but anything can happen, though. Anyway. Let mushroom ourselves away from out of here. Cause I'm not too comfortable being this bot now. Nor am I too satisfied with the roll I just got. Mario's gonna be using the mushroom here. I don't think he's gonna that's not gonna get him to the star. We'll put it much closer, though. Ooh, just barely avoid Peach's face. Kinda glad that happened. I kinda have a plan of what I wanna do here. Alright, who- how many speeds are stunning Peach this time? Only two. I believe the max for that can be five. But I could be wrong. And 
perfect timing for a battle mini game. I've been waiting for that to happen again. Come on, high bid! Okay, that's pretty good. A battle for 80 coins? I'll take it. Alright, so what do we have this time? Stand by me, Hyper Sniper, or Control Stick? Hyper Sniper. Let's choose Hyper Sniper. I like that minigame pretty good. Fire at target as they scroll down the screen. Whoever scores the most points is the winner. Control Stick to move the scope. A to shoot. Beware of Bowser's target. Hit one and your point will re be resetted back to zero. The big fat zero. Go! Uh huh. Somebody already hit the Bowser's bay! <laughs> Yike! Someone must really love Bowser if, if that's the case. Ah! Ah, come on! Hit the- hit the hundred! There we go. Nope. Uh-huh. Alright, who's winning money? It looks like it's me. Almost hit the Bowser space right there. Jodet is winning it, and Mario is winning it. Peach getting nothing. Good day, sir! I like the- yeah, I'm gonna be really honest with you. I love the battle mini games in, in this one. It's much better than some of the other ones that we have encountered so far. Also, we do a greater chance as well. Uh, let's see. Who's the better option to swap to? Micah is saying Toadette. So, let's try to hit it with a warp pipe. Nope, didn't get- Nope, didn't get Toadette. Nope, timed it too late. Dang it. We thought he land on our character space, though. That was- That could've- That could've ended disastrously for me. But I'm glad it didn't. Glad it didn't, though. Using a lot more- lot, Using a lot more orbs now. Than I was for the first half the turn. Getting a lot of duels here, though. And it looks like we got a really high bid. Mario is feeling super confident right now. He believes he can beat Toadette, but will that be the case or will that not? He lost a piece, but can he beat Toadette in Mass Meteor? This is a race to the finish mini game. Basically, all you do is avoid. Meteors. The best you can and be the first to hit the finish line. Alright, racers are ready! And, and, it, and it's a swim across base! Who's gonna be the first to hit the meteor? And that first person is gonna be Toadette! Toadette already hit two! Three! Mario only hit one! Mario has a very good boost of a lead right now! Toadette is just bogging his head meteor after meteors right now. It looked like Mario is going to be be the one easily taking a victor spot and winning a lot of coin. But that upset could change. But knowing Conan's luck, I think her luck just ran out. Which means she's going to go deeper into the ranking. Netting Mario the win. And with that, Mario is the victor! Putting Toadette to dead last! After contesting me for first for so long! Things are starting to go downhill for Toadette from here on out! Could there be an upset coming from Mario? Well, maybe, but hopefully not! We'll see, though. And I believe Mario is getting dueled again. 
I believe Mario is getting dueled again by Princess Peach. Which means one of them could be could be getting more richer. Will Mario win again or will Peach get it this time? Peach is also super confident about defeating Mario, but can she do it? Hopefully not. But we'll see. Next one is Bonanza. Oh man! Oh man, I wanted to play this minigame because this minigame is so cute! Move, all you do is move around and, and get your pink, miniature pink boo to your own area. For Pete, it would be the left side. For Mario, it would be on the right. This is a really cute minigame, I'm gonna be honest. And I'm really sad I'd, that I'm not the one playing this minigame. Because cause if it was me right now, I'd be dominating. Just saying. And it looks like the winner of this minigame is gonna be Mario. Beating her by three points. Yes, Mario finally got his revenge against... Princess Peach! The richer gets richer! As Mario is now very well over 100 coins. And if, and if coins start with there, she'd definitely be getting the bonus star. But, but too bad that is no longer the case here. A battle mini game could still come and play though. Catch you later. I believe this is another one that we already have played. So I don't need to go over that. Boom! Time to collect the mail! Go. Wow, that was convenient! That was right close to me! Mail guy! Mail guy! Mail guy! Oh, mail guy! Come on, collect my love letter! I have to give it to Lady Bo for Valentine's Day! Uh... No, she got my Valentine's card! Wait, too bad she didn't deliver it, though! Yep! This Boo is definitely dominating the competition right now. Not the Princess of the Mushroom Kingdom, the Hero of the Mushroom Kingdom, and nor could the Mushroom Brat counterpart is able to stop me currently as of right now. Well, looks like he's gonna be cruising by an easy, easy victory because Pink Boo is no longer available. He is done for this board. And I got another useless Boo Away Orb. A Boo Away Orb that means absolutely nothing. Alright, okay. So, Alright. DK or Duel? Let's see. DK or Duel? I want DK. I think I've done enough dueling for the day. Uh. You know what? Let's dig deeper into the lead, perhaps. By getting the Super Shroom. Let's see if we get another mini game. I sure hope we do. Be nice. And well, my, my wish is going to be granted here. But for how much though is the question. It is going to be for... Just every single banana we collected. Not triple this time. Next one is Pure Factor. This is the second DK minigame out of the three. Choose one of the five barrels. The barrel will collect bananas as they move down the pier. Pick a barrel with the control stick and press A to confirm. If barrel hit each other, they will change direction. I believe we do get to see a pattern here. And it looks like we do. Let's see. Uh, let's see here. Um, I'm gonna choose the one all the way to. I'm gonna choose the one all the way to the right. 
Because I want that bunch of banana. I think it'd be really good right now. Question is, who's gonna get the bunch of banana? It is Princess Peach. Of course it had to be her. Finish. Lisa had more bananas than her that time. <laughs> Since she screwed me over on the last one. That kind of made up for that last DK mini game, but but not by much though. But it'll do. I actually don't know what that pose is. If I'm gonna be honest, that and I mean the pose that DK does before he leaves. I'm not sure what that's supposed to be, but it's weird. But the question is, did Mario just get the star? No! Nope! She, nope! He missed it! He missed! Missed it! Mario missed! She hit... Peach's trap! And loses 10 coins to her! But man, that was a lucky break! He almost got the star right there! But did Toadette do the same? No, she was also short. But a duel is being initiated. Anyone could get that star. It could be me, or it could be Peach now. But we will find out after the next duel mini game come up. Yeah, we're getting a lot of duels here. Asteroid Rage. This is one that... Asteroid Rage. That is one that I actually did in the duel. So, let's see who survives. Who can dot the meteors the best? Will it be the Mushroom Brat counterpart? Or will it be the Hero of the Mushroom Kingdom? A lot of, a lot of them are cutting it close. And it looks like... It's a draw! It's a draw! They hit the same meteor! Which means the coins are offset yet again! This is the second time we saw a duel in a tie! Unfortunately for Toadette, she's losing coins to Peach! As Mario did just seconds earlier. Minutes earlier. I guess I should say. Alright Peach, what's she gonna do? She cannot reach the star! She can't reach the star! I just realized she can't! Not with the sluggish shroom orb! Yet another battle mini game coming up! Another battle mini game has come into play, and this time it's for three coins! Man, we're having an exciting event right now, aren't we? Uh, I big at 120 coins! And it looked like we're stuck on Rathlin' Wapid. Looks like they really wanted to get beat in a fighting minigame. Sounds like they love losing. Hand them a lot? I shall do. Let's do this. Wee-ya! Wee-ya! Get out of here, Toadette! Nope. Alright. The coins are mine, Mario! You're rich enough! You're rich enough! You guys chose poorly picking that minigame. Very poorly. Now this ghost is more richer than ever before. With a whopping 83 coin in possession. Don't quite have the coin lead, but you know what? I don't care! At least I'm beating everyone. And I pretty much have this victory locked in no matter what. I have this victory locked in no matter what happens. Maybe even get two stars in one turn if I'm lucky enough. 
we'll, we'll see if that's the case here. I have it all but locked up. And it don't look like that two stars in one turn is gonna happen, but the star is gonna be right where it was at first thing last time. But in terms of who got the happening star, I think that might be a tie. I'm thinking that might be a tie, but I'm not 100% sure on that. I also just realized Toad is broke. Yike! Boy, how the mighty Mushroom Brat counterpart has fallen. The, the mighty female Mushroom Brat. Oh no! Oh no, I think I know why she did that. She wanted to take a ride on that! Fluff Airline! Apparently she wants to go on an adventure before this game ends. But where are they going to take her? They are going to take her to the top left, it would seem. Close to where Woody is. Last minigame is going to be a 2 versus 2 on Clean Team, which is a team-based minigame, obviously, where each player has a role. Team up with a partner to fight Window Grind. The first team to clean all the monk off their windows is the winner. Prayer with the spray, spray bottle. Move around and press A to spray foam. Player wiping the window. Control stick to move and A to wipe it. Bucket cannot be passed, so plan your route to avoid wasting valuable time. Well, this might this might go bad for me, but then again, it might also not. But we'll see. And there you see a demonstration on what we gotta do. Go. She does the cleaning, I do. She does the spraying, I do the cleanup. Uh huh. Uh, Toadette! Toadette! Anytime you want to start spraying, bud! Toadette! Toadette! What are you doing? What is she doing? She's just running all over the place. She has no idea where the last one is. How does she not? Yeah, it looks like we're gonna be okay. It seems like the AI aren't on the other side isn't really doing any better at this point. So me and Toadette wins that last mini game. Okay! So that concludes our first board. I think the results are pretty obvious here, but we'll, let's find out who gets the bonus story anyway. Well played! It's time to see how everyone fared. First, let's count everyone's star. Five, five for me and none for the AI. Pretty simple math. Tally up everyone's coin. 124 for me, 140 for Mario, 19 for Toadette, and 32 for Peach. As for the bonus star, we have the minigame star, which which makes a return. And I'm pretty sure that one goes to me. Unsurprisingly. The orb star is what I'm interested in. That could be anyone. Two orb star winner, and that is me and Toadette! Happening Star, I think that might have been Peach on that very last turn. Two Action Star winner. It is me and Peach! Which means Mari was the only one without a star. Not quite a star sweep, but I'll take it though. Mari last, Toadette is third, and Peach is in second. And the winner is none other than your favorite ghost of them all! 
Boo! It's a superstar here! Easily creamed his opponent! Without question! Finalizing the total of 8 stars and 124 coins! Peach is in second place, edging Toadette out by 13 coins! Both her and Toadette got 1 star, Peach got 32, Toadette got 19, and Mario unfortunately never got a star in his possession and ended with 140 coins. As for stats, I had the most coin count, or er, sorry, star count, obviously. Final coin count, Mario had the most. I easily dominated in the minigame. Me and Toad have barely edged out Mario and Peach for the most orb use. Mario Toadette with the most blue space, me and Mario with the most red, More char most character space with, with Mario and Peach, happening space with me and Peach, most duel with me, no miracle space, which means no chance time, thankfully. Me and her landed on, me and Princess Peach landed on Bowser, Bowser, Peach did it twice, and then me and Toadette landed on the DK space. And that will conclude for the first round of Party Mode for Mario Party 6. Quite, quite a, quite a big turn of event with having a lot of duels and battles and some chaos and stuff. Even if it was one-sided at the very end. So, with that said, that is going to be it for this episode of Mario Party 6. So, once again, I want to thank you guys all so much for watching it. And remember, if you enjoyed this episode of Mario Party 6 and you'd like to see the next board, don't forget to punch that like button. Next time, we're going to be paying a visit to Professor Egad inside his garage. So join back here next time. So, once again, I am Fightman64. See you all. Have a good day. Game on, my friends, and take care. Goodbye, everybody, and stay safe. Adios.